Hey everybody, welcome to another Poverty Hill Adventures woods bombing video. And before we get uh, get going on today's hanging around and and woods bombing, uh, um, I'd like to like to say a little something. Uh, and first off, I'd like to acknowledge all all the all the people that watch the channel regular and leave all the real nice comments and and. Uh, a lot of you I'm beginning to consider friends, you know, uh, uh, friendships through uh, through YouTube and through the internet. So that's real cool. Um, but there, I got one guy uh, that uh, just wants to spread some negativity, I guess. And, uh, you know, Johnny Paycheck had a song back, uh, oh, back, I guess in the 70s. Uh, Johnny Paycheck, uh, country singer. Had a lot of a lot of great songs, and uh, uh, I think this song might have been titled something like "Colorado Kool Aid." And uh, and uh, Johnny and a bunch of his buddies are hanging out in a honky tonk, and they're having a real good time, a real fun time, just messing around, having a good time, uh, enjoying each other's company. Uh, and uh, this one fellow shows up, and uh, Johnny describes him as. Uh, you know the type of fellow who uh, just ain't got no friends, uh, and uh, and he shows up and tries to spoil their good time. Well, um, I'm not going to change my good time. I'm not going to change my fun I'm having with these videos. I'm not going to change what I'm doing. So uh, um, I just wanted to let the uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, our version of Johnny Paycheck's uh, guy in the bar uh, uh, know that nothing's going to change here it's just going to be what it is and all of you guys that, that enjoy hanging out here and and watching the videos and you know just doing what we do you know fishing hunting and and camping and like today just hanging out in the woods uh i do appreciate you very much and i had an idea i had an idea for just this one uh video guys if uh instead of uh you know, leaving a thumbs up or, or whatever. Let's send Mr. Negativity uh, a message and let's all give this video a thumbs down. That'll make his voice uh, unheard and uh, hopefully he'll find a, a new uh, place to, uh, to, you know, uh, come and spread negativity. So let's get started with today's video. Uh, we're going to do some woods bumming. I, uh, I got some some crazy ideas for today, uh, uh, a little bit different than uh, our normal woods bumming video. Uh, so I hope you stick around and I hope you enjoy yourself. Thank you. I started a new hobby in my retirement uh, to stay busy, you know, uh, and uh, I decided to teach myself how to paint paintings. Uh, now I'm not very good. And I may never become very good, but uh, I want to do this. I want to. I want to try to to learn to paint. And one of the uh, ways that I'm trying to teach myself is by watching uh, old uh, PBS uh, videos with Bob Ross. Bob Ross was a was a painter uh, on PBS, and he would paint uh, the most beautiful. Uh, nature scenes uh he was inspired from uh, uh when he lived in alaska and he would paint just spectacular paintings uh and he would do all this in a half an hour in a half an hour on a half an hour pbs uh show he would paint a painting and uh in each episode bob uh, has uh some some uh, quotes that, that have become famous and one of his quotes was uh, along the lines uh, and I hope I don't get this wrong is uh, it's okay to have trees as friends <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I uh, I gotta say I got a lot of trees that are friends <laughs> so uh, I thought uh, today I would have an art show for my friends uh, my tree friends out here in the forest uh, and uh, I'm hoping that maybe you can join me and I can show uh, some of my uh, my artwork. Again, uh, I, I don't claim to, to be very good at any of this, 
but I, uh, I'm having fun doing it, and I want to encourage uh, all of you to have fun at something, even if you're not good at it. Just, just give it a try. So uh, uh, let's uh, check out the art show. This painting here I titled uh, Smoke Pole, and it's uh, a painting of uh, my 50 caliber uh, flintlock rifle. The next painting uh, is titled The Hobo Hilton, and it features uh, a tent cap that I used last fall, uh, and uh, the little symbol on there is a uh, from the Hobo sang Sign Language, and it uh, means a good place to camp. This painting I titled uh, Maple Syrup Time, and it was inspired by uh, my friend Dino and his uh, maple syrup uh, uh, making in the spring. This painting of the archery target and uh, recurve bow is titled, With Practice, Anything is Possible. And that uh, quote came from Bob Ross. This one here is titled, Fish in the Small Pond. And uh, if you look real close, you'll see uh, there's a little turtle up on the shore with the uh, wildflowers and uh, I uh, included the jitterbug tree back in the corner there, the jitterbug tree, my nemesis, the jitterbug tree, which always seems to uh, snag my lures when I fish there. This one here is a uh, painting that I painted of a, a moth, and the moth <laughs> was the most spectacular moth. I found them uh, on the outside of the tent uh, last fall, and uh, it, it had it bright uh, yellow wings, and he had what appeared to be big eyes on the wings, and uh, I took a picture of that moth, uh, and I think it's even in one of the videos, and uh, I used the picture as my model when I painted this one recently. This one is titled Woods Bumming. This one here is titled Home Sweet Home. And it's a nice spring day. Uh, got a trout stream there to, to fish and uh, being there it's springtime, there's a strutting turkey and a little fawn. The wildflowers are out. Uh, nice cabin, uh, log cabin. Got a little chair to sit on out there. Uh, and uh, there's a crosscut saw and a little lantern hanging from the outside of the, uh, the painting. And uh, if you look real close over here in this uh, apple tree, is a cardinal. Uh, like Bob Ross uh, always said, it's your world. You can paint it any way you want to. This one here is uh, titled Today in the Workshop. And uh, there's uh, a couple of axes waiting to be worked on in the workshop. And uh, the workbench, and then, uh, of course, some of uh, Grandpa's uh, tools hanging up on the workshop. Uh, it's a, it's a, f a fun one that I painted uh, uh, of my little workshop and uh, some of the fun projects that I work on in the workshop. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. The last uh, painting in today's show is uh, titled, What's for Lunch? And uh, the painting uh, features uh, a little uh, tin corn boiler, uh, a fork, and a knife that my good friend Rob, you saw Rob in the last uh, woods bumming video that he made for me. 
Uh, and uh, I hope everybody enjoyed the show. <laughs> I know I enjoy. I enjoyed uh, uh, putting the paintings out here in the forest so that all my tree friends and all my uh, YouTube friends could uh, could see what I've been up to with the painting. As long as we're just hanging out, <laughs> uh, talking, doing a little woods bumming today, uh, I uh, wrote down a couple of things that I wanted to mention. Uh, and uh, I like making YouTube videos. I enjoy it. Uh, it's a lot of fun for me. I enjoy it. Uh, as you can tell, I've got several hundred of them, uh, uh, some better than others, uh, up on uh, this channel. But as much as I enjoy making YouTube videos, I equally enjoy watching other people's YouTube videos. Uh, and I wrote down some here that I wanted to share with everybody, give them a shout out. Uh, uh, the first one, most of you who, who've been around the channel for a while know of this guy, and that's Kevin and Gobbler's Roost Adventures. Great channel. Kevin and I uh, collaborate on a lot of, a lot of videos. Uh, Kevin's a hunter, a fisherman, uh, and he's an antique hunter, and he comes up with some great antique uh, finds. So I wanted to mention him. I'd also like to mention Cottrell's Hunting and Tramping. And uh, I believe he's out of West Virginia. I'm not 100% sure, certain, but I believe he's out of West Virginia. Uh, got some great videos, uh, some really good stuff. I love muzzleloading. Uh, there's a young fellow with a channel called I Love Muzzleloading. And uh, if you like uh, muzzleloaders, check out this guy's channel. He's got some great stuff on there. Plain Old Chuck. Plain Old Chuck. Uh, uh, Plain Old Chuck does a lot of uh, cast iron type cooking. Uh, is into uh, Coleman lanterns and all that kind of stuff. Great guy, great guy. You'd love to, I'd love to spend some time around a campfire with plain old Chuck. Um, Hometown Angling TV is another one. Good channel, solid channel. Uh, check him out. Um, uh, Georgia Trapping and Fishing. Georgia Trapping and Fishing. Uh, that's a good channel, let me tell you. Uh, and... I happened to stop by Georgia. <laughs> he was having a live stream. Boy, was it fun. Uh, he was live stream from the first shed. Him and another fellow were uh, just hanging out like we are today, just talking. Uh, now, it was interactive because it was a live stream. And uh, I'm going to have to teach myself how to, how to do live streams. I'd love to do a live stream. Uh, and, you know, just uh, have some fun with everybody. But that's Georgia Trapping and Fishing. Great channel, great channel. Um, I've mentioned this one before. It's Robert Badden. I hope I said that right, Robert. Uh, Robert is a trapper up in the bush country, uh, up uh, way up north. And he's got some, what I consider some of the best videos uh, on YouTube. Uh, very talented guy, uh, mostly trapping, does some uh, other subjects, uh, just real, another real positive guy. Uh, I always enjoy uh, his videos. Uh, I think uh, uh, you might like him. And then I just found a new channel, and it's Hans the Carver, and it's a guy that... Uh, um, lives pretty close to me i didn't even i never knew i never knew who he was uh and he uh uh does some incredible fish carvings he does uh um some lure making and he also is a uh a fishing charter uh uh captain so uh that's hans the carver robert badden hometown angling tv georgia trapping and fishing Plain old Chuck, Cottrell's hunting and trapping. Uh, I love muzzle loading, and of course, uh, Kevin and Gobbler's Roost. If anybody, 
is still watching this video i hope there's i hope there's at least one or two uh that are still watching this video and it didn't click off a long time ago uh, the the other thing that i wanted to do today in this woods bumming video was just take a hike and 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 take the camera and take some pictures i want to take some pictures just pictures in general uh uh of the woods and creeks and such uh, and uh Maybe, maybe include them in some upcoming videos, uh, but more than likely I'll use those, uh, those pictures as uh, examples uh, when I continue uh, with some more paintings. So uh, if you'd like to take a little hike with me in the woods, uh, come on along. <laughs> I think I got uh, some good pictures. I appreciate you putting up with me in this kind of goofy video that I made today. Uh, before you know it, spring will be here and uh, we'll be back out fishing. Uh, fishing the streams and the ponds. They don't have much ice in them this year, so I think we're going to get into the ponds real, real early. Uh, we'll be out turkey hunting, camping, doing all kinds of good stuff. So uh, uh, I guess it was good today just to kick back and, you know, maybe just relax, recharge our batteries a little bit. I appreciate all of you, and uh, I appreciate you, you putting up with, uh, with me and some of these uh, goofy videos that I make. Until next time, everybody, take care, thanks for watching, and remember, keep on trucking.